नमस्कार प्राग न्यूजर समग्र दर्शक प्राग विशेष आई पी एल स्पेसियल पवार्ड बन एक्सप्रेटर अन खंड स्वागत जानसो आज गुवाहाटी आई पी एल आज जी मेट हम गई गुवाहाटर बार्सापारा स्टेडियम राजस्थान रयल्स भार्सेस पंजाब किंगस आज फाइट कर अलग कथ पाती क्रिकेटर विशेषज्ञ आमंत्रण करतीम्धे आम संयोजित मिस्टर नयल डेविड तक फर्माल इंटरनेशनल क्रिकेटर वेलकाम टू द डिस्काशन सर आन जन भार्गव मेरा कारेन्ट फार्ष्ट क्लास क्रिकेटर फर इंडियन रेलवेज वेलकाम टू द डिस्काशन जेंटलमेन सो आज उ नो दट टूडेज मेट इज गोईंग टू भी हेल्ड इन बार्सापारा स्टेडियम एंड गुवाहाटी राजस्थान रयल्स भार्सेस पंजाब किंगस एट 7:30 p.m. So my first question to Mr. Noel Devi sir is: The Rajasthan is now on a three-game losing streak. What has gone so wrong for this team that once topped the table? Uh, yeah, it's, it's very surprising to see Rajasthan Royals losing consecutive three matches, right. which no one expected. Uh, unfortunately, unexpected. I think uh, the uh, yeah unexpected, mm -hmm. but. Uh, Yes, I, I feel that you know. I think in one way, you know, the early wicket which are falling uh, for Rajasthan. You know, we, we have seen the three matches. They, you know, the uh, Butler was got, got out early in S against S R H. You know, then uh, you know the middle order not clicking a little bit. You know, Sam, Sanjay Samson. One game, yes, one game was very close against Delhi Capital, which they lost uh, unfortunately. Uh, you know, through a bad decision. But that all happens in cricket. But what I say is, they are a very much be a, a better side. But uh, losing three games, as we all uh, never expected. But I think they will come very good today because they know that they have to stay up the order, you know. And they uh, they have a better run rate. They have 12, uh, you know, uh, 14 to 16 points on the table. They ha they are very ahead. And I feel that today's game will be a, a lovely game. You know, Punjab also on the other end. You know they have lost, but they have beaten best side, uh, and you know uh, they are also you know uh, they'll be uh, reckoning to beat uh, uh, Ara. Mm -hmm. So let's wait and watch today's game because they are playing at uh, playing in Guwahati. Guwahati is a very good ground and uh, and a good wicket to play on. So I feel that the the match will go to to till the end. Okay, Vargas, so what do you think about it? What do you think about Rajasthan Royals? I think it. Yeah, it's going to be a great, exciting match today, and uh, it's a great opportunity for Ara to get those two points and uh, book their berth for the qualification. I think uh, they have lost last three games, uh, but one was very close against uh, SRH, where they lost in mm. last over. Throughout mm. the tournament, they have played really good cricket. Uh, Rajasthan Royals, where you can see seven, eight players have contributed uh, to the winning cause, and it's not depending on one or two players. Uh, as the case with the Punjab Kings eleven, where they are heavily dependent on Sasan Singh uh, and Ashutosh Sharma and uh, uh, their bowling lineup, Harshal Patel, Arshdeep Singh. So they are very much depending uh, on three, four guys. Whereas uh, Rajasthan Royals, all the guys are in form. They will try to come back. They will uh, try to lose, uh, break this losing streak, and uh, they will book their place for the qualification. Okay. It was a uh, season to forget for Punjab. What was the biggest reason for them once again failing to make the playoffs, sir? David, sir. We feel, you know, uh, the start of the IPL and what I felt is that Punjab uh, was not gelling together. You know, the the injury of uh, the captain Shikhar Dhawan mm -hmm. uh, plus the start what they were getting uh, was not quite enough. They were not using the first six overs. You know, they were all depending. You know, Shashank Singh as Bargo said, Shashank Singh, Ashutosh. You know, one them, uh, you know, uh, you know, gave them that score in the middle order. I feel that uh, overall, if you see the overall of the team, I think all three departments uh, uh, never came good for them this year. You know, uh, when they beat uh, Chennai Super Kings or when they beat uh, a few other teams, I think that's the time we could see the Punjab uh, eleven. You know, uh, you know, that was the team which you. We were all looking forward, but uh, unfortunately, nothing clicked for them. Nothing clicked for them because they have depended more on their captain. But uh, he got injured. You know, Bristol came uh, one out game. He came very good. Then later on, 
you know, he, he started to fail. You know, uh, Shashank Singh, you know, was, was, was among runs. Ashish was, was among runs. Ashdeep Singh was, you know, was getting those initial wickets, but unfortunately, no one was there to back him up. Uh, if you say, if I wind it up, it is, it's a bad IPL for uh, Punjab Kings. Okay, okay. So, Rajasthan needs one more win to officially become the second team granted a playoff bird. Can they get it versus Punjab? Bhargat, sir. If there was ever a, if there was ever a game, I think this is the game where Rajasthan will try to get those two points because Punjab is in not good form. They are very inconsistent on their day. They can beat any team, but Rajasthan will back their team. I think they'll try to uh, break this losing uh, streak and uh, they'll try to play their best because they have guys in form. Uh, yes, as we as well as Kodran, Sanju Samsung as Kodran. It will be a home ground for Ryan Parag as well. He's been in good form, so I think he'll come good. We can see a hundred from him as well. He has scored a lot of runs in uh, Assam Premier League over there on his home ground. So I think uh, Rajasthan will be uh, trying to win this game. Okay, Devicha. Would you like to add? Yeah. That? Yes, you know, this is the correct time, as Bargav said. You know, it's the correct time for encashment for RR and get back to the winning habits again because uh, playoff is nearby. They will try to, you know, get all the plays active in an active mode again, you know, because they can't afford to lose one more game where, you know, it becomes a, uh, uh, their moral, their, their confidence will start falling low. So I don't think uh, RR will let this game go away from their hands. They will look all, all, uh, you know, with, they will be like a hunting wolves going around with the 11 pack of hunting wolves. They'll go against Punjab 11. They have, you know, uh, the captain who lead from the front is is among good runs. You have the local boy where the crowd will be coming to see him. You know, don't take me wrong. I have seen this lad from under 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 19 onwards. He's a he's a future for the country and he was with me during the NCA National uh, Zonal Academies and I found that this guy can really uh, be a threat to any team if he gets going and he's been and we are all the Assamese will be looking for a forward a big knock from him and I find that he will get he will be good on the day uh, there is uh, you know uh, they will be looking to the uh, this game and I find that RR will go all out to beat Punjab okay Devicha, let me uh, ask you one another question. If you were at the auction table, which Punjab player would you retain and why? Uh, it's a difficult thing to answer because what I feel is, you know, uh, there are few. See, I will retain. See, as, as the year IPL started, everyone was surprised who the Shashan thing is because it came out in the paper, uh, papers that surprised. You know, Pritha, Pritha Zinta, you know, unknowingly picked up Shatan. I'll be the first person to retain him. Hmm. Okay. And Ashutosh. And of course, yes, Ashdeep is there. And, you know, I will retain Bresto also because uh, Bresto is one guy, very dangerous. If he gets going, he's very dangerous. We have seen him that 100 against SRH. And I find that, uh, you know, these guys uh, will be the key, key guys. If you take the bowling department, you know, Harsh Patel has been has been a tremendous uh, uh, form. He's been bowling very well. You know, we, we can see his what slow ones he bowls, slow depth yorkers. Super B has been among all the time. You see, he's there. He's there taking wickets. And I find that there are five to five players which Punjab will retain, and uh, and I will be sure that uh, these guys will be you know uh, playing for Punjab again next year. Okay, same question goes to Bhargav Merai, sir. If you were at the auction table, which Punjab player would you retain? I think Punjab had a very unfung uh, unforgettable tournament this year because they were very inconsistent. Uh, performance from the players have been inconsistent. Uh, one player, if you look, who's very consistent is Hasar Patel. He's been picking wickets. He's been highest wicket taker for Punjab Kings 11 this year. And... Uh, their home ground is Mullanpur, Punjab. So, mm -hmm. there the boundaries are slightly bigger. Slower balls will be very effective. So, looking at those things, I think Harshtar Patel will be their first choice. They'll uh, look to uh, get him back again for the next year. 
I think second choice will be uh, Liam Livingston because uh, obviously he's not been among the runs this season, but he's a great big hitter, great threat. He bowls a little bit of leg spin as well. So he's a bit of useful in those conditions in Mullanpur. So I think uh, he's also there and also Sasan Singh will be there. I think uh, accidentally picked up by Punjab Kings 11, but I think they knew. Because uh, Sasan Singh scored a lot of runs this year in domestic cricket. He scored uh, 117 Vijay Hazare, 115 Vijay Hazare. So, I think uh, they were looking for him and they picked him. But uh, they'll also try to retain him again for the next season. Okay, any piece of advice to both the team from your side? Well, uh, I, I would love to, you know, tell them, you know, uh, this game RR will not... Uh, will not give it away easy because mm. they are already lost three games. I think Sanjay Samson will be knowing. I think he will, as I said, he will be hunting for our uh, Punjab 11. Mm. And uh, at the same time, Punjab needs to pull up their uh, game because I know they are nowhere in uh, contention for IPL 2024 qualification. I think they will play for, as this game as a pride. They will look to finish off their season with winning notes. And I hope that uh, both this match will be a keen contest on cards. Okay, very good, sir. Would you like to... Yes, yeah, same. I think uh, RR's last game is against KKR and they will not uh, try to keep it till the last game. They will want to qualify in this game only and they will give all their efforts in this game. I think as Noel sir said, uh, 11 Wolf will be there on the ground and they look to hunt Punjab Kings 11. Uh, and from Punjab side, I think a uh, lot of international players are there. They are going for World Cups. Uh, so, it will be a good game for them as well. Uh, Sam Karan is there. Liam Livingston is there. Uh, then Rabada is also there. So, I think a lot of uh, uh, foreigner players are there who are going for World Cup. And uh, obviously, they will play for pride. They have been inconsistent on their day. They can beat any side. They have shown this in uh, this IPL. So, I think uh, they will also try to play for pride as well. Thank you, gentlemen, for joining us and sparing a little time from your busy schedule. Hi, Priyadar Khok, here are still Mr. Noel David and Bhargav Merai. Take care, Hokole. Aji Ji Khan Khel Gwahati Barsha Pada Stadium and Hobole Goya Se. Rastan Royals vs. Punjab Kings. He can be a good one. Hamma Gyan Amale Agbo Hale. Doi Dati Mole. Amar Falar Prakhubishya Zona. Yonu Sana Pamoy Hamiran Jane. Midai Magisho. Thank you.